Hi, my name is Ron Wilson, and I wanted to spend a few minutes with you today and help you understand DevOps a little bit better. What is DevOps? DevOps is the combination of cultural philosophies, practices, and tools that increases an organization's ability to deliver applications and services at high velocity, evolving and improving products at a faster pace than organizations using traditional software development and infrastructure management process. This speed enables organizations to better serve their customers and compete more effectively in the market. If you look at the diagram below, you'll see your company and your customers and how the interaction takes place. You will establish a delivery pipeline that includes build, test, release, monitor, and plan, and you'll have a continuous feedback loop. Under a DevOps model, development and operations teams are no longer siloed. Sometimes these two teams are merged into a single team where the engineers work across the entire application lifecycle, from development and test to deployment to operations and develop a range of skills not limited to a single function. Quality assurance and security teams may also become more tightly integrated with development and operations and throughout the application lifecycle. These teams use practices to automate processes that historically have been manually and slow. They use a technology stack and tooling which help them operate and evolve applications quickly and reliably. These tools also help engineers independently accomplish tasks, for example, deploying code or provisioning infrastructure that normally would have required help from other teams and this further increases a team's velocity. There are several DevOps benefits and here are a few of them. Speed. Move faster as a team so there will be more product produced. Quality. Develop higher quality products with faster feedback loops resulting in continuous quality deliveries. Collaboration. Smaller teams work more efficiently together and eliminate organizational silos. Scale. Manage deployment and infrastructure, leveraging automation to accelerate productivity. Security. Using a DevOps model, companies can ensure security compliance. I believe that it is important to develop a quality DevOps mindset. The customer is always number one frequent delivery of a working software product. Develop a quality product over production delivery. Keep technical debt at a minimum. You need to have constant communication with all team members. Keep things as simple as possible. Hold meaningful and actionable retrospective sessions and automate as much as possible. Here are a few of the DevOps myths that you may have heard. DevOps will fix everything. DevOps is for developers and operations only. DevOps only involves automating processes. DevOps only uses cloud. DevOps only uses new languages and technologies. DevOps is only for web-based systems. DevOps only is used by small companies. DevOps is not necessary for my organization. Here's a little bit of history about DevOps. In 2008, Patrick Dubois helped plant the seeds of the DevOps movement at the Agile Conference in Toronto. In 2009, at the O'Reilly Conference Center, John Ausball and Paul Hammond deliver a talk known as 10 Deployments Per Day. In 2009, Debois launches the first DevOps Days event in Ghent, Belgium. In 2010, the first U.S. DevOps Days is organized with the help of Willis as well as other DevOps proponents like Damon Edwards and Andrew Clay Schaefer. In 2011, Cameron Height from Gartner predicts that by 2015, 20% of global 2000 businesses will embrace DevOps. 
In 2012, various DevOps days are popping up from Bangalore to Boston. In 2013, various DevOps books are published, such as The Phoenix Project, Implementing Lean Software Development, The Lean Startup, Web Operations, Continuous Delivery, and The Goal. In 2014, DevOps crosses into the enterprise and brands like Target, Nordstrom, and Legro embrace the movement. In a survey by Puppet Labs, IT Revolution Press, and ThoughtWorks, 16% of 1,485 respondents say they are a part of a DevOps effort within their organization. And in 2016, as we all know, DevOps is now mainstream. Here are a few DevOps goals that your organization needs to accomplish. You need to build repeatable processes and high quality software. You must automate as much as you can. It is important that you and the team understand the definition of done. You need to reduce risk. You need to have collaborative ownership and everybody is responsible. You all must constantly communicate and it is necessary to have continuous improvements. It is important to build quality throughout the entire DevOps process. You need to automate unit testing. You need to identify defects early and often. It is important to execute early performance testing. The product owner must be frequently involved. You need to maintain low technical debt. It is important to have functional and automated testing, and it is critical to have version control. I hope this has been helpful. If you need some additional information, you can visit my website at qarevolution.com or visit my YouTube channel at QA Revolution. Thank you, and I hope you have a great day.